Suad Abdelrahim is the first woman president of the Tunis City Council in the history of Tunisia. The mayor of Tunis is one of the most prestigious and difficult positions in the North African country. Running for the position of mayor was a challenge. I dedicate my victory to all Tunisian and Arab women. It's proof that women are competent. They can serve in senior state and managerial positions. Suad Abdelrahim is one of the founders of the post-revolution political system in Tunisia. She was member of the parliamentary group of the Annahda Islamic Movement after the 2011 elections. She also contributed to the drafting of the 2014 constitution. During the three-year experience in parliament at the decisive phase in the history of Tunisia, the former MP learned how to deal with urgent problems. Now listening to citizens and civil servants is part of her job. The mayor is a courageous and hard-working politician. We trust her and we rely on her knowledge to make Tunis a beacon of hope in the region. The 54-year-old pharmacist has an ambitious but a very realistic program. The mayor is the candidate of the Annahda Islamic movement. Now the Sheikh of Tunis will work closely with 60 councillors from different parties and political affiliation. We have many partners on the city council. I believe in dialogue and consensus building to resolve the problems of Tunis and serve its residents. People want to live in neighborhoods that are clean, safe and friendly. A beautiful, clean and safe city. This is the main objective of the new mayor and her administration. Tunisia is viewed as the most advanced Arab country in terms of women's rights. The election of Suad Abdelrahim has shown that the North African state is experiencing a successful democratic transition. Adnan Shawishi, CGTN, Tunis.